Ball change. Now leading 4-3. Well, that's interesting because John is only serving at 44% in this second set. And when he's missed his first serve, he's only won three out of 10 points. And Connors just again took advantage of a second serve. John said going into this match that he'd like to be serving at 65% against Jimmy. He said, if I could do that, I could swing out a lot more freely on my returns. Explains in large part why he's struggling in the second. He did say to you yesterday he had to serve well. To beat Jimmy, and the reason Connors has such a good return. John respects that. No! What a missed opportunity for Jimmy. He constructed that point so beautifully, he's tearing his hair out that he missed a chance to win a very big point. And the fans. Can sympathize with him. It was a big chance. Little Chi Chi Rodriguez there with the racket. God, he had that ball set up well. Put John down, love 30. Instead, it's all even, 15 all. Connors has been picking on himself most often in this match about the fact that he's just not moving as well as he'd like. Especially against John's serve that winds right into you if you're not careful. You've got to be very alert. Move quickly. And another missed opportunity after a terrific reply on the serve. Bothering Jimmy right now as he knows it's slipping away. Macaron needs five points on his serve and the match is over. So Connors must do something different to break back. Just out. McEnroe leads 5 3. McEnroe leads 5 3. I'll tell you one. A little notice away from tennis. I'm so happy that this is uh, a match of two left-handers winning a victory for Southpaws everywhere. Both of these players playing wearing wedding rings on their right hands. <laughs> Boy, I'm a lefty as well as you are, Ted. I do the same thing. The abuse we take for that is <laughs> immense. here he's out of the tournament McEnroe will continue to pressure that second serve a late but good call John really jumped on top of that Second serve by Jimmy. That's what he did so well against Edberg last night. He hasn't done it as much in this match, but he sure did it beautifully here. Look at this backhand. He jumps right into the court and takes it with his feet off the ground, and it won him the point. John can feel it. Fifteen thirty. Fifteen thirty. Thank you. 
unforced error by Connors on the forehand side. Now we have a match point. Two match points for McEnroe. Aggressively attacking. Particularly against John, because if you don't come in, he will. As you'll see on the second serve, if Jimmy didn't make a first serve, McEnroe will attack. Continues his second consecutive tournament victory as he wins the Trans America Open, defeating Jimmy Connors 7 6 6 3. And we will return with the award ceremonies in San Francisco right Ladies after this. Gentlemen, please stay with us for the awards presentation. Thank you.